I want to welcome you back to Dream Chasers Radio with me, your host, Yaya Diamond. Welcome to the show. We have a great show for you today. You can get us on iTunes, Google Play, Stitcher, Spreaker, Spotify, TuneIn, Deezer, YouTube, Vimeo, Roku, Amazon Fire. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel, Dream Chasers Radio. That's Dream Chasers Radio. We have programs in English now in Spanish. So you're going to love it. Yes. We'll be right back. Don't you go anywhere. <laughs> Welcome back to the show. Okay, so yes, we have a guest today. Of course we have guests, but we will be doing something soon because people want to hear my mind. I don't know if you want to do that really, but okay, I'm going to give it to you just like you asked for it. <laughs> but today we have a great, great interview and I am so happy to have a, um, just a fellow musician on the show. So please tell everybody who you are and what you do, please. Right. Um, thank you so much for having me on your show today. I really love to be on your show. I look forward to it today. And here am I. Thank you so much for having me. My name is Emmanuel Osawaru, Saint Emmanuel Osawaru. I'm a gospel artist and also uh, an entrepreneur. I'm a songwriter. I'm a preacher too. I, I'm, my background is on civil and structural engineer. I'm an engineer by profession. That's what I'm trained to. Nice, nice. So, okay, so why gospel music? Gospel music has been, uh, this, is what has been, this is what has been my passion right from a child. Okay, I have a calling. God calls me while I was 17 years old. And that calling has been born so much in my heart. And ever since I have never stopped. Even mm -hmm. as times where I, I kind of uh, fall, fall away a little bit. But I see get a pull back into the kingdom. So mm -hmm. that's, the word, that's the reason I use the word as sent. Because I've always seen myself sent into the whole world. Mm -hmm. So gospel music is part of me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. You know, music can be a part of somebody's soul and spirit, and then the calling comes with it, you know, and I truly believe that if that's something that you are called to do, you need to be in your calling, definitely, definitely be in that calling, because if not, you're miserable. <laughs> that's right, that's so correct. Everything goes downhill from there. <laughs> that's right. So wow. So tell me about your, your experience. I mean, what is it like to be a gospel artist? Is it different than being like a regular artist? Ah, beautiful. Um, to be a gospel artist, it has to be really a calling. It has to be a passion because, you see, when you're doing a regular secular music, a lot of people want to get connected into it. But when you're doing a gospel song, because Satan is out there trying to fight what you're doing because you're not actually doing it for money. Like I, I'm not really doing it for money or for fame. I'm doing it because I'm called to do it. So sometimes when you're doing these things, if you don't have a passion, if you don't have a calling to it, you can easily let go of it. You can easily give up on it. Unlike the secular music where you get a lot of people jumping at you and, and they want you because of the song. But you see, with the gospel of the song, you are actually preaching Yahweh to them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's nice. different. I hear you. I hear you. Wow. Okay. You said Yahweh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Tell me about that. Good. So Yahweh <laughs> is... God Almighty is the mm -hmm. Hebrew word for God. God is a creator of heaven and earth. The Bible let us know that within the whole world consists. Without him, there is nothing that will exist because he spoke the whole world into existence. Mm -hmm. So he is the creator of heaven and the earth. Mm -hmm. Where did you learn that? Where did you learn Yahweh? How, how do you know that? 
I know that because he reveals himself to me in different formats. And one of the way he has revealed himself to me is here. Yeah. He revealed himself to me when I was very little. And he said to me, I am your God. Years ago, I used to pray. I wanted to be an engineer. I, I, wanted, I really wanted to be one of the best engineers all over the world. Mm -hmm. And every time I pray, I said, Lord, I want to be best engineer, make engineer. And he says, engineer of souls. He said, I am your, I'm, for you, I am Yahweh. So he made himself, he, he, he gave me the revelation. And immediately I key into the revelation. Mm -hmm. My life just moved from glory to glory. And it mm -hmm. never ceased ever since. Hmm. Did you ever try to run away from your calling? I did. <laughs> oh, I'll tell you a little bit about it. I did and I got punished for it. Oh, Ooh. Oh my goodness. I actually tried to run away because, you know, I wanted to just run away and enjoy uh, the other side of life. But you see, when I walked out of my calling, I run into the end of the enemy. Mm. They, they welcomed me in and they wanted to smash me because they know that I carried a calling from God. Mm -hmm. But you see, when when they when they came against me like a flood, they wanted to squeeze me. Mm -hmm. And then I remember Yahweh. And I, have, I have to come back to him and say, Lord, say, help me. And mm -hmm. Like Samson did. And he helped me and mm -hmm. pulled me back home. Mm -hmm. Do you believe that other people have different callings in their life? Like not everybody has a calling to be a pastor or to be this or be that. Um, that everybody has a different uh, ministry or a different yes. path that they must take. And I even believe. though it may not be gospel music, it may be love, yes. relationship. Because, I mean, think about it this way. I mean, if we all sing in gospel, then how do we know about love and relationships in songs? Right. You know, because I truly like Aretha Franklin sometimes. And I thought that she was an amazing vocalist as a, as a uh, gospel, because she did gospel in the beginning. Uh, Mahalia Jackson was always playing in my home, okay? <laughs> so, mm -hmm. But we also did a little bit of Earth, Wind & Fire. So, I mean, that, that, that kind of music was always playing, but it wasn't the music like, yeah. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know what I'm trying to say, right? You know I what I'm do. saying, right? So, I, I mean, do. Do, do you believe that everybody has their own path that they have to take that the Most High has already, or Yahweh has already ordained for them to take, and that even That's if they correct. step out of that path, they're in misery? That's right. The church, you're very correct. Everybody has their own calling. Not everybody are called to be a minister. Even some pastors you see today, some of them are not called to be a pastor. They are only called to tell people about the love of God. By the time they made themselves pastors, they struggle. When you, mm -hmm. when you are doing something that you're not called to do, you struggle. But when you're actually called for something you're doing, and you're in that art, you mm -hmm. find it, even when there's trials and temptation, you, you, you have a conviction within you that mm -hmm. this thing is my calling. And you go through joyfully. Some people are called to just be a teacher. I tell people, you might just be called to be a primary school teacher. Do it mm -hmm. with joy. You can be called to just be a, a wife. Mm -hmm. Do it with joy and raise your children to the best. You can be called to just be a husband. It doesn't need to be a, a gospel artist at all. Mm -hmm. But just do it with joy. Right. I mean, some people are called to be nurses and doctors and help right. restore people's bodies. You That's know, right. so um, I think that everybody has something they need to do. And if you don't fulfill yours, I can't do mine. That's right. Yeah, definitely, definitely. Wow. So what, you know, what, what kind of songs do you have? I mean, I know that you have one that you sent me. Tell me about that one. Tell me about that song. Okay. I'll actually, I'll, uh, I, I love the father you brought that song up i want to talk to you about it the song i have an album is called i love you jesus it was my first album for many years i've always sing. i've always sing with other gospel artists and play instrument enjoy the choir but i haven't really done mine but last year the holy spirit said to me do me a song he literally asked me to do it 
And I said, Lord, but I don't even have a song. I had no region. And then he said, do me a song. I said, dear God, okay. I started to pray. And then he gave me a song while I was sleeping in my sleep. I started singing and singing and sang loud out of my sleep. Immediately I took a pen and I wrote it down. Mm -hmm. So then, you see, there were puzzles. They didn't match up. And mm -hmm. I said, oh, they didn't match up, yeah? <laughs> so I kept praying. And then I, I said, so open my Bible, give me words quickly and say, how do you talk? So when I put those words together, it became a song. And mm -hmm. then it led me. By, it led me into, um, I went to the studio. When I got to the studio, it looked as if I'd be a musician. I've been singing for years. Words mm -hmm. just started coming out. And the one I sent to you was my best. I call it my best because it was my letter. I call it a letter to Yahweh. That mm -hmm. was my letter to Jesus Christ. Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. it's called I Love You, Jesus. Every, nice. every of my being is in a song. Mm -hmm. Every of my being. Wow. Wonderful. Well, I want to thank you so much for being on the show. You know, where can people find you? On You have a social media page. YouTube, Facebook, I website. <laughs> I do, I do. So I have um, I have an Instagram. It's mm -hmm. called. Um, you can actually assess my Instagram with at Emmanuel Usawaru. Emmanuel spelled E M M A N U E L. Usawaru is O S A W A R U, or at K dot Osawaru one. You can also assess it that way. So and on my Facebook page, you can assess it as simple. It's just Emmanuel Osawaru. It's my Facebook page as well. And my, my YouTube channel is called because uh, I have a record label now. I have mm -hmm. a record label. It's called Saint Symphony Records. Mm -hmm. In one word, Saint S A I N T S Y M. P-H-O-N-Y, St. Symphony Records. Mm -hmm. So you can always nice. And then we have a, I have my own website as well. It's called St. Symphony's Records .com. Awesome. Awesome. Well, thank you so much again for being on the show. You guys, we're going to have all that information in the description box below. So all you have to do is copy and paste that into your browser if it's not highlighted. If it is highlighted, just click on it. It'll take you straight there. And as you've been watching this video, if you're watching on YouTube or Vimeo, Amazon Fire or Roku, then that would be right under him. So you will see at least his Instagram right under him. So that way you guys can go and follow him. I'm going to go ahead and back out and say thank you guys so much for tuning in to Dream Chasers Radio. And don't forget to dare to be different. Well, Mr. Emmanuel, Saint Emmanuel. Oh, Sororo. Oh, gosh. Oh, I'm so, thank I, you. You I tried. It. <laughs> <laughs> well, go ahead and introduce this song to you. Go right ahead. The album is uh, I Love You, Jesus. And one of it is um, I Love You, Jesus, actually. Okay. Uh, so that's the end Yeah, I want to go ahead and play that right now. <laughs> thank you so much for being on the show and thank you guys again here's that song i love you jesus
One day the Marikina must plan to kill him with an accident. At the bus stop where he normally wait for the boss. On that fateful day, this brother was waiting for the boss. There was a beautiful girl on the other side of the road, opposite the bus stop. This brother went to the girl. As he turned back, behold, a truck ran into the bus stop. The same spot where the brother was standing. And when he looked to the other side where the girl was, the girl disappeared. An angel appeared and saved him in the form of a beautiful girl. What can God not do for his children? What can he not do? He knows how to keep us. The Bible says he preserved us. Above all the names, his name is Miracle. His name is Lord. His name is Lord. Higher, higher, higher. I'm 